wow okay and then we have another rare which i don't even care about um okay this is this is insane video What's up turtles and tortoises? It's a wanted turtle and today we are doing another magic video. We got some mail for mail day. We got some more Dominaria po packs. We got a cute little turtle that my girlfriend got me for Valentine's Day and let's get into it. So, and so for those who are not aware, Ultimate Masters is a little set that came out not too long ago. Uh, boxes, I think the MSRP was like 350 and right now they're probably going for like $400 on eBay. So some really strong cards and this is the first one we're gonna show off, Noble High Arc. And so we actually have two of those. And Older Masters, again, the boxes are crazy expensive, such good cards. Um, and maybe one day we'll open one of those on the channel. And our last card is a Tarmogoyf which is such a strong card in the, oh, these are actually from Modern Masters. Oh, I forgot about that. So we have two Tarmogoyfs. This card is just very iconic for a two drop. And depending on what the graveyards look like, they can be um, anywhere from zero one to, well, they get pretty strong. And so that is a Tarmogoyf. Really cool art too. So we did get two of those. All right, and again, we have one more package, so I'll do stick around to the end of the video, see some very awesome legacy cards. All right, and we're sticking with Dominaria right now. We have 12 packs of Dominaria. See if we can't hit another Tafari. We did pull one a while back, so if you haven't seen that video, I definitely recommend checking it out. And let's just, we're gonna start going through some of the comments just to see if there's any, uh, for people that are unfamiliar with the set, uh, they might just appreciate the art and uh, if there's any cards that you're interested in looking at, you can just kind of pause the video. And then we're going to primarily focus on the co uncommons. So we got a Thorn Elemental. And then the rare is a Four Bears Blade. And then we got a Cursed. And to pack number two, we got a Jaya Ballard Art. Charge. Pierce the Sky. Short Sword. Oh, these cards are very sticky. Okay, second pack, we got a Fire Fist Adept. Sarah Angel, very... Oh my gosh! Wow, I was totally, I was half joking when I was saying, oh man, maybe we could pull a full oil Tafari. Wow, okay, and then we have another rare, which I don't even care about. Um, okay, this is, this is insane video. I didn't really believe what I saw at first. Foil Tafari, so non-foil, this card goes, I don't know, for $50 or something. Um, I need to find some sleeves. Uh, wow, I totally shocked right now uh, oh my gosh I can't believe we pulled this this is the best card I could have hoped for oh my gosh I can't believe we got that that is the best hit of the channel so far guys this is a this is gonna be a very good video we got ultimate masters card modern masters mythics of Tarmogoyfs none, none, nonetheless. Oh gosh, I can't even talk. Oh, all right, we gotta keep going. We got Time of Ice, Weight of Memory, and then Shall I Voice of Plenty? Don't even care. Oh my gosh, guys, this, I can't believe we hit that. Like, it was a half joke when I said, oh, let's let's try to pull pull this Tafari card, and that's why we're going opening this booster box. And Ooh, Fisher's Army Dragon Post. Alright, let's see. We got the Songs of Freelis. Spore Crown Thaliad. A first eruption with a foil syncopate. I'll, I'll try to put a caption for what the current rate is 
for the foil version of that card. My gosh. Ooh, this is a pretty good card. Seal away. And then we got a dinosaur. Oh, I can't even focus right now. Still processing that pull. Alright, we got Knight of Grace with First Strike and Hexproof from Black. Sage of Latinam. And then a Mishra Self Replicator. Five. I think I saw an opening on another channel called Bad Boy Gaming that pulled that card, and that, that's why I wanted to open more Dominaria. And he mentioned that this was like the first time that ever got open on, on YouTube, and maybe this one will be the second. Oh. <laughs> I thought that was something else for a second. So we have a Oath of Tafari. Uh, I almost lost. Almost went crazy. Oh. Still got four more packs. At this point, we still have like um, some more packs from that same box, but I think we're done with Dominaria. We cannot top that. It is impossible. Like, from, yeah, to me it's impossible to beat this box that we just opened. It, we can only go down from here. Juggernaut, ooh, clip top retreat. One of the land cycles, we got a, it's red white land. At this point, pulling pulling those is very. We don't need those home runs anymore. We already got the grand slam. All right, let's see. Fuddle, Sergeant Arms. Ooh, that card's pretty cool. Grow from the Ashes, Rescue. Bolus's Crutches, Clutches. Gilded Lotus. This card's actually pretty cool. Ooh, Foil Common. And we got two packs left, and then we're gonna open our very vintage mail. I'll give you a hint. It is some dual land action, which if you're familiar with, if you're not familiar with Magic the Gathering, the original Dual Lands, uh, they're essentially only, you can only use them in Legacy format. And they're kind of like two lands in one. So very versatile. Ooh, we did get another Mythic in Multani. Alright, for the last pack, that we don't need anything else because we already hit the best card we could possibly pull in Dauntless Bodyguard for one, Orcish Vandal, and then Kamal's Druidic, Druidic Vow. Druidic Vow. And we got another box inside. And we have Plateau. So this is red, white, which makes sense for Plateau, where it's like a mountain and then plains on top. So, these are super old cards. This is from the revised set. This is like the third set, kind of. So we got one plateau, two plateaus, three and four plateaus. Awesome, awesome cards. Very happy to pick these up. And believe it or not, that the plateaus are is not the highlight of the video. The highlight of the video is that we pulled a foil Tafari I still can't believe we pulled this. Um, yeah, again, it was it was a joke when I said, "Oh, we're gonna open, continue opening Dominaria, so we can pull that card." Like I do, can't even imagine what the odds of that are. I think I mentioned that in a different video. Oh, I'm st stunned right now. But thanks for watching, guys. Uh, this has just been a legendary opening, completely epic, best pull of the channel so far. Um, so I would appreciate if you did hit that like button. If you're not already, become a subscriber. Hit the bell for notification for future videos. Follow me on Instagram. I will be, I have, I've been pretty bad about it lately, but I'm going to be continuing to post more pictures there. And yeah, thanks for all the support, guys. I hope to have crazy videos like this in the future again. Thanks for watching. I'll catch you guys next time. Peace.